and already have a blood meal available. It happened to me. I was visiting the compound of the dog owner that complained he had too many ticks, too many ticks, so he stopped so many ticks, all these ticks, ticks, ticks. So I went with him into the dog house. I think he had three mastiffs, two, three mastiffs. Too many for my liking, anyhow. And I didn't think we stayed in the dog house for two, three minutes. And when I came out, I felt something crawling in my hair. And then, on closer inspection, it were baby ticks. And not only one baby tick. Honestly, that was really one of the nastiest things I experienced. But luckily, I could show the dog owner where the problem came from. <laughs> The little bit brains <laughs> could have tried it himself to go into the dog house and see what happened. But people here think that, I don't know, parasites are appearing like this. They are. Well, I don't know. The wizard of Banjo drops them in your compound. Grand Marabout puts a spell on you and then you are full of ticks. Voodoo. It's not voodoo, it's science. <laughs> <laughs>